Everyone knows Adventure Time can be a little crazy, but there's this one episode that exceeds the usual amount of crazy that seemingly no one is talking about. What honestly concerns me. Food Chain. In Food Chain, Magic Man pulls a prank on Finn and Jake, letting them live through the entire food chain in an hallucination. First, they turn into small birds, then into big birds, and so on. Doesn't sound so bad so far, right? Well, apart from spontaneously busting out the bird rendition of Mozart's magic flute, I'll tell you now why the episode is really messed up. Finn and Jake's minds are retained as they are turned into the various things. Seemingly, they do not have 100% control over their bodies, but they are still Finn and Jake and can also freely communicate their opinions and feelings. For example, right off the bat, they discuss how they like being birds. Knowing that, a completely new, disturbing light is shed onto everything that happens from this point on. Finn becomes a bigger bird and is totally about to eat Jake. Due to being at a certain level in the food chain, his urge to eat the smaller Jake bird is too big to fight. Making Finn feel like eating Jake, his best friend and brother, is what he truly wants. Just imagine he would have succeeded and realized what he'd done when his hunger no longer controls his mind. That sounds like something straight out of a lost episode, creepypasta. Later on, when they are caterpillars, it takes Finn like 5 minutes to fall head over heels for a female caterpillar. Is this just because he's a caterpillar now? Or is Finn kinky as fuck? As a reminder, he has canonically fallen in love with a flame and a literal lump of bubblegum before. Not to kink shame him though, I know he hasn't touched a real woman for the first 15 years of his life. In addition, the caterpillars were shown to be able to talk, to have a whole culture, and also to be capable of feeling real emotions like love. In other words, they are not much different from us humans or any other species from Oo. Thus, by having the caterpillars devoured later on, Adventure Time accidentally portrayed actual genocide on screen. To make things even worse, Finn turns into the attacking bird right before he's eaten, so that he ends up swallowing his own wife. Given the topic, the episode in fact involves a bunch of weird eating experiences, like Finn turning into bacteria and eating his own dead bird buddy, and Finn and Jake being eaten alive by caterpillars in their flower forms. Remember, they are more or less conscious during the whole process, and probably scarred for life. Ultimately, thinking about this episode seriously, it becomes apparent that only Finn was overtaken by nature's urges, while Jake was never tempted in the slightest. Only Finn falls in love with a caterpillar. Jake can't understand it. Finn eats way more caterpillars than Jake and cannot resist eating Jake. While Jake is constantly questioning Finn's behavior, there could be two reasons for this. Either Finn is the only one being controlled because he is a human, an unmutated being in contrast to Jake. Or alternatively, Jake is the exception and cannot be swept away by temptations of the earth because he is the offspring of an extraterrestrial life form that does not experience earthly urges as strongly as as an earthly creature like Finn. Though Finn does not consider this, instead bursting into a song about the circle of life before becoming a biblically accurate angel. And then, no one ever talks about this ever again. For more episodes no one talks about and other cartoon and anime content, subscribe to Frogtoons.